Yeah, it was an interesting leg. Um, we had a bit of everything in the conditions. No, first the first day, great running conditions. Then the second day, the only thing that mattered was getting past Gibraltar in one piece and having the boat ready for the for the second part of the race, which was our main obje objective. I think in that part we actually pushed down a little bit, looked for the looked for the conditions where we thought it would be better for the boat and then the good thing is that we were able to push 100% after Gibraltar and then quite a good race for us until the end. Um, at, the, at the very end we were very close to being third, we were already third um, a couple, one or two miles from the finish but in these kind of conditions we know that anything can happen and we're getting used to these kind of finishes which is exciting and, and very, very tiring for us. <laughs> yeah well um, it helps in the boat handling, in the conditions, knowing that, that y you can get through those 35, 40 knots. Um, in the end, it, it's a completely different game once we have a not, uh, the other boats racing with. Um, of course, the other 7,000 miles we did were uh, quite a bit um, less stressful regarding the competition, so you, you don't push as hard. Um, it, for sure it helps, but I think right now the learning curve is going really steep. Yeah, definitely enjoying it. The competition is, is amazing. We're in the mix, which is the main objective, and and we just have to take our chances. There's still one more leg and a cup and an import race, so we're ready for that. No, yeah, it means a lot. I mean, uh, right now we're in Alicante, and it, it will be. I was here a couple of years ago, and it's a real. It's it's amazing to see Sayula's name on the trophy, no, and also in the a big picture of Sayula. And, so it's it's a, although it only Mexico has only participated with one boat in the ocean race before, it surely marked, and then here we are 50 years after trying to do the same. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's a goal. Well, for the first big goal was just getting back into the race. Um, this is still not the ocean race, but it's one step closer to it. And then from here, the idea is to keep keep on working on the project and and be on the start starting line in the in 2022. <laughs>